Hello ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to ServiceNow 911. In the series of Tokyo upgrades, today we will discuss two points with respect to no code procedure. Let's go to the instance. So here first of all let me go to App Engine Studio. Let me go to my app. This is the demo app and here I have two tables. Let me open one of the table that is demo table 2. So this is the table here I have a field known as demo field. So this is the demo field instead of clicking here that is delete field. Now we have the option to inactivate that just like in our traditional tables. Okay, so no need to delete it. Just remove it from here inactive and then save it. The field will no longer appears in the form. Okay, so in order to activate it again, just go to the table, click here and activate it. Save it. The field will appear again. And the second most important thing is formula builder for any field like here. In this demo field what I am doing I am adding a formula here like this concatenation created by then this field name on this. So what I am doing here I am not using any script or anything in order to update the value of the field. It is just a straightforward formula and the function name is concatenation like this there are n number of functions are available so you see here formula for column values in the table builder so you see average divide max minimum all these are the functions which are available and we are using concatenation which will join one or more input string into a single string so that's what i am doing without any code just look at the formula here so how to add the things you just need to use concatenation you see the function here first name comma then you have this dot comma then last name comma then at the rate it means you have to write the field name as it is and then if you want to add any string just use the inverted commas okay so same way I have added here concatenation braces created by this is a simple string in the quotes and then name of the field comma then on this is also a string in the quotes and then sys created on this is the name of the field right date field so save it now preview it open form in the platform choice one save it you see here created by this is the simple text then admin that is name of the logged in user on this is the date right so so this is one of the fantastic update which is provided in the Tokyo release with no code facility right just just add the string and the field name and you can have a value in a field in whatever way you want so I hope you make full use of it see you next video subscribe to the channel thank you so much bye bye